Hi, I'm Broderick, a first year robotics member. And I'm Sam, a first year FRC member. And I'm Brianna, a team lead. And we are the Goon Squad, Team 3604 from Woodhaven, Michigan. As a team, we focus on building equal opportunities and sustainability within all first programs. To ensure that we are active in our community, our team engages in plenty of outreach activities, including service projects, such as Kids Against Hunger, Ringing the Salvation Army Bells, and crocheting stuffed animals for the Sunshine Project. It is these events that raise awareness of what we stand for. I'd like to have some fun while we do it. Our team annually hosts a golf fundraiser and outreach event. Last year, 96 players made teams that participated. We get sponsors for every hole, which last year totaled 38 from our local community. In the past three years, we have raised $25,000 from this event. And afterwards, we treat everyone to a nice steak dinner. Another fundraiser that we annually host is our trivia night. This is a night we invite family members of students, members of the community, and other FRC teams to come have a fun night while supporting the team. 100% of our proceeds, which is $15,000 in the past three years, goes to scholarships for our seniors. Furthermore, with our local alliance of teams, Datara, we hosted a presentation of how strategy dictates design to 150 attendees at our kickoff for this year's game. We also hosted breakout strategy sessions with members of all 10 present teams. In addition, we host a coding seminar at our shop, co-founded by me and our coding mentor, Ricky. Six FRC teams, roughly 20 students attended last year. And this year, we plan on hosting 12 teams, which is roughly 60 students. This is a 300% increase from last year. At this seminar, we teach about programming with example code and show how we use it in our robot. Another great example of how we strive to benefit first was our AAUW STEM Savvy All Girls Conference. This conference was an interactive presentation that explains what robotics is and how it can be beneficial in many ways. We shot up our robot and every student got the chance to ask questions and have a hands-on experience. We met girls from 19 different middle schools and we love seeing them get excited about first. We absolutely love seeing diversity in robotics and there are so many more ways in which we Foster this inclusivity. We annually host the Gunnett Invitational, an all-girls off-season event that strives to introduce more girls into STEAM. Last year, we had over 600 participants as we maintain an open-door policy. But this isn't just for students. Last year, 75% of all key volunteers identified as female. Gunnett's is one of the only seven all-girls off-season events in the entire world. And from 2022 to 2023 alone, female participation increased by 63% and website traffic increased by 73%. Last year, we hosted 32 teams. And this year, we plan on hosting 64 teams. This will make us achieve our goal of hosting the largest all-girls off-season event in the entire world. However, we take this even further. Along this event, we host the hands-on hallway in which we invite multiple tech businesses, such as Ford, Slantis, GM, universities, and other teams to bring in their amazing tech to allow for completely hands-on learning experience. This is the only off-season hands-on hallway in the entire world and is open to people of all ages. Through this event, we caught the attention of news station Detroit Local 4. They interviewed us and our segment reached 57,000 households. In the past three years, we have been in at least four different media publications. Another way in which we support the younger generations of FIRST is through our FLL and FTC teams. Last fall, several of our members volunteered to mentor every single meeting at the majority of our schools. 100% of the teams who have ever started or mentored are still active to this day. To support these kids' skills, we support a seven-week-long robotics camp for middle schoolers that teaches them the values of teamwork and robotics as a whole. This year, we reached over 40 students, a 67% increase from last year. I've been mentoring at this camp for the past two years now, and it has been amazing to watch these kids grow. I am seeing them go from not knowing a single thing about robotics to feeling a winning alliance. At this camp, I help teach shop safety, gracious professionalism, and competition strategies. This camp, plus our mentoring as a whole, is a great example of how we on the Goon Squad strive for sustainability. This fall, we are taking this even further by bringing the Goon Squad, the Goonies, and two of our FLL teams to one building, which will allow us to mentor them easier and more efficiently. Our district is putting $25,000 towards this program, which is not only an investment in our sustainability, but also the legacy that we are building. This district program will reach more than 150 students across 14 district teams and counting, and is the only district-wide robotics program in the entire Metro Detroit area. However, none of this would have been possible without the generous support of our sponsors. 
We see our sponsors as members of the team, and we strive for an equally beneficial relationship between all of them. Last year, we assisted our sponsor, Altair Engineering, in becoming a first Michigan sponsor and then a bronze level sponsor first in a span of two months. Altair created the software as RapidMiner and Inspire, which assist teams in building and designing their robots, and they wanted us to test them out for them. Three Goon Squad student representatives traveled to Altair to discuss how their software could benefit the entirety of Berks and gave feedback on how to improve it. We presented Inspire and all of its fantastic capabilities to every single FRC team in Michigan over Zoom, totaling 624 teams. This later assisted their software to be included in the kit of parts in which its CAD, CAM, animation, programming, and circuit design softwares are now available to more than 3,500 FRC teams. If it wasn't for our assistance, this software would not be available to every FRC team in the world, which has been reviewed by Colin a Dean's List finalist as, despite being very simple, it is very powerful. Our feedback was even presented to Dean Cameron himself by Altair representatives. Altair has even gone as far as send 20 plus representatives to our home event by handing out these flyers. They even visited us at our Livonia event. It is simple to say that our team members are strong believers that going beyond expectations is just as important as meeting them. We are building a legacy for the younger generation, hosting the U.S. Invitational, the hands-on hallway, and mentoring these teams with all of the core values of FIRST. We go beyond for our sponsors, assisting Altair Engineering in becoming a Bronzeville sponsor of FIRST and sharing their software with the world. And most importantly, we go beyond for each other not only setting up these students for the careers they want, but also setting them up to be the people they want to be. And that's how important it is for our team to go beyond. Mm. Yay. All right.